Please, I feel the energy of confusion, okay? We got some situations going on. I got two storylines here. One is regarding a job and one and haters on a job. And one is regarding making decisions, okay? So decisions, a hater, some type of work situation is seriously on somebody's mind here, okay? Um, listen, somebody definitely um, is well, willing to like throw the towel in, okay? They're ready for this, this cycle to change. They're ready for a new beginning. They're ready for some type of freedom. They're ready for... Um, let me just pull these other cards here. They're ready for um, some type of new beginning, okay? Um, they're tired of the old and they want the new, okay? It's just that simple. It's like somebody is getting very, very fed up with this lack, this doubt when it comes down to whatever decisions need to be made and when it comes down to um, going into their North Node, going into their purpose, okay? Um, there is a situation here to where I feel like somebody is ready to bring their sexy, crazy, cool out, okay? Um, sexy, vivacious, strong, courageous, fiery, passionate, optimistic, chaotic, funny, um, and uh, hot-tempered. Listen, somebody is tired of wearing a mask. Somebody is tired of living life the way, um, you know, that is not uh, exciting or nor is, is limited. I'll put it to you like that, okay? Um, they're ready for some type of celebration. They're ready for, um, you know, get-togethers, um, you know, socialization, abundance is what they're ready for as well. They're sick and tired of this mental anguish. They're sick and tired of remembering things that no longer serves them or have hurt them, okay, or have let them down or frustrated them. Um, they're tired of being in mental anguish, having, you know, being indecisive when we know we need to make a decision here. Um, stalemate, denial, information overload waiting it out, emotional block, insecure, difficult cho choice, or rigid. One word, all words, you guys. Somebody is ready to come up out of this energy, okay? Somebody is tired of the mask that they've been wearing, okay? Their belief in themselves has increased. They're ready to show up in the world and live out loud, okay? they Like I said, they're ready for their sexy, crazy, cool back. They want to party. They want to um, involve themselves in external events, um, you know, going out. You know, if you guys are in the limelight, if there's an entrepreneurship thing that you're ready to do, you're ready to take off, okay? There is something that is stagnating and somebody, something that is confusing and somebody has to damn sure make a decision to get this energy up out of their life okay because this is a burden y'all okay it's, it's a serious ass burden okay somebody is burnt out this restriction is killing them okay um somebody is overwhelmed and somebody is stressed somebody wants change the thing is is that they have to have courage in which they have because i got shrimp sitting right here in the middle of my table okay so there is an energy that somebody can muster up all right and use mind over matter mind over heart okay self-awareness conviction Courage, self-love, instinct, bravery, and fearlessness, okay? To get out of this lack and doubt mentality, this emotion, this entity. Lack and doubt is a spirit, okay? To get away from that spirit, okay? And go towards your north node, which is your purpose, okay? Somebody is bursting at the seams to do this, okay? There is a love situation here. Okay, it could be baby mom, baby dad. Somebody definitely does have a soul tie with this person. It's a possible reunion. It's a possible not reunion. That car came up upside, upside down. But you know what? We got free will, okay? So, you know, just because a car comes up upside down does not necessarily mean that that, you know, is written in stone. Because what I have now is I got separation versus longing, okay? So just like I said, we got a situation to where somebody wants reunion, okay? But we got separation versus longing. Somebody's on the fence. Once again decisions okay once again this is love okay the decisions is also work all right i believe that the reason why that um something is not going well with these haters okay because they are haters what they're saying is <clears throat> behind your back what they're saying is we know why you keep getting special privileges bitch that's what they're saying we know why you keep getting spiritual pri I mean, not, we know why you keep getting special privileges, bitch. Okay, that's what they're saying. All right, that's your haters. All right, so when it comes down to this hater situation, all right, somebody is definitely sticking in here with it. They know that it's toxicity. I feel like some of you guys know that it's haters. There's um, some type of patterns that go along with it. Somebody has tried to avoid this. This shit is at a stalemate. Somebody's ready to get off this. This 
roller coaster of a ride when it comes down to these people, these co-workers, um, you know, business partners, collaboration, networking individuals that you guys deal with, okay? Because somebody's about to start balancing out the scales here, okay? We're about to make this thing just a little bit more fair on, on every side here, okay? Um, somebody definitely is juggling. Um, somebody is definitely profit and loss. Somebody is trying to adapt. Financial stress is here, okay? And also, you know, job stress is here as well. A lot of defensiveness going on here, okay? Somebody is going to rub somebody the wrong way here when it comes down to love or when it comes down to this work situation, okay? And there's going to be defensiveness. There's going to be protectiveness. Aries is going to show up as how Aries show up. I'll put it to you like that, okay? You know, with all the, you know, resistance and under attack standing ground and, you know, you know how y'all do, okay? Um, so, you know, something is definitely going to have to be done about this. Now, when it comes down to this love, Aries, there's, here we go again, okay? We got decisions in from a whole nother deck. We got decisions from this deck, okay? And we got other decisions as well, okay? So, when it comes down to this love, I love you too, man. When it comes down to this love, okay, this is supposed to be happy family, all right? Just supposed to be blessing, this this family life, these gatherings, you know, possibly a reunion, okay? Um, somebody definitely is clinging on, okay? That could be you or that could be someone else, all right? But somebody definitely is clinging on, okay? Um, like I said, somebody is ready to get off the fence. And, and off the fence is where they're going to be uh, headed here because we got the world card, okay? This is freedom, y'all. This is ending of a cycle, brand new cycle beginning, okay? Um, spiritual graduation, infinite possibilities, completion, okay? And happiness, closure, could be graduation too for some of you guys, okay? Nonetheless, I got releasing, surrender, and purging, okay? So I feel like somebody is ready to release and purge the facade, okay? Um, of, you know, they're not living their life in the way that they want to. They're not living their life out loud, okay? That's the facade, all right? Um, they're ready to celebrate. They're ready for abundance. They're ready for gifts, okay? They're ready to release this here burden, okay? They're ready for this change, and as soon as they hit this here, a major arcana energy, they are going to do that because they're going to have mind over matter, mind over heart, self-awareness, conviction, and fearlessness, being brave, okay? When it comes down to this love, I got this twice. I got four of wands and I got two and ten of cups, okay? This is somebody's baby mom, baby dad, soulmate, twin flame, connection, higher connection, okay? Marriage, all right? This somebody definitely is going through separation, thinking about separation, longing for this person, Somebody wants a reunion, somebody is clinging on to this, and somebody got a, a serious ass decision to make. Makes me feel like somebody is resistant, okay? I don't know why I feel that way. I just do, okay? Um, but somebody is avoiding something. Somebody is at a stalemate. And I believe if it has anything to do with the job, because this is the pinnacles, um, I believe it has something to do with where, where's my next move? What is my next move? You know what I'm saying? Am I going to go all in on that thing that I want to do as far as my own business is concerned? Am I going to, you know, still stick it out here with this situation with these hating ass individuals that I got? to be up and around and work around. This could be a supervisor, manager, whatever fuck person it is. I, I really just don't even care. That's your, that's your job. I, I don't, you know, they haters to me. You know, I'm reading the cards, okay? Bottom line is, is, um, you know, they real slimy, okay? You guys, they crawl on their belly. It's just what, I, they snakish, all right? Um, they don't want to see you win. They don't want to see you come up. They got all already preconceived notions about you, all right? And this shit right here is not cool, okay, at all, on no level, all right? Um, and then on top of that, it's also, um, what did you call it? It's Y'all, it's been a while, okay? Um, but it's what, hostile work environment? You see what I'm saying? This is a hostile work environment. You see what I'm saying? I really feel like somebody want to throw hands with one day co-workers. I really do. Don't do that though, okay? Go see a supervisor, even though I feel like one of these individuals is a fucking supervisor, okay? So the only thing that you really can do is either leave. You see what I'm saying? Go find something else, you know, similar to your position, um, or just start over. There's a lot of areas that are very talented. I got so many areas that I know that has their own businesses. You guys, you guys, when it comes down to ideas and implementing those plans and researching, I don't, there are some that can stand next to you Aries. Okay. But when it comes down to that, listen, y'all got that in the bag. Okay. So if it's something that you want to do as far as your own business or whatever goes, you know, go ahead, go for it, you know, go for it. Because honestly, you really don't have nothing, you know, to lose dealing with these hating ass, you know, op ass individuals 
you know what I'm saying, that, you know, this is where they're going to be, y'all, okay? So if you got a job and you working with these hating ass individuals, you know, this is where they're going to be, okay? So five years from now, you start your business, okay? You done glue all the way up, okay? This ass is still going to be there, okay? Because that's, that's their future, you see what I'm saying? You can't sit up here and hate on people and feel like you're fixing to come up. Um, it just don't work like that. Energy don't work like that, okay? So we got somebody here, okay? I'm about to get into the tarot, you guys. Aries, my day ones, my VIPs, and my community members, much love, much respect, you guys. I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for riding with me. Um, for my new and recent subscribers, thank you so much for accepting my invitation to subscribe, you guys. I am very happy that you are here. Um, if you have not let me know, please go in the comment section below. Let me know that you're new to the channel, and that way I can give you a warm welcome that you definitely do deserve, okay? For the ones that have not subscribed, please accept my invitation to subscribe. There are a lot of things that are happening on this channel, okay? Uh, for every 100 new subscribers, somebody will get a free read. Um, my mystery grabs are very fun. They're very random, and also so my monthly giveaways, tarot cards, oracle cards, or um, or free reads, you guys, okay? So speaking of which, into a tarot, okay? If you guys are interested in tarot cards, oracle cards, or bundles, um, you guys visit their site. Their site will be, a uh, link will be uh, to their site underneath my title in my description box. Whatever you purchase there, you will get 10% off, okay? Um, and uh, yeah, use my code, okay, at checkout, all right? So it's HRH Nikki Tarot, HRH Nikki Tarot, all caps, okay? You guys, my community members, I'm pushing my community members because you guys get so many perks, okay? So please join the community page. All you have to do is click the join button. Um, you guys will get um, one free question answered a week, okay? Put your situation down there. When I pull letters, you guys, you know, you guys, you guys going to have so many, you guys have so many perks. You got half off, half off of my VIP plans, half off of my personal reads right now. And um, like I said, the free question, okay? And plus on top of that, if you guys get letters and that resonates with you, for my community members, you guys also know what that is, okay? So join, 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 you guys, okay? Listen, if you guys are interested in a personal read, VIP, any one of my VIP plans, please visit my uh, description box. You guys will see, um, if you guys scroll all the way down, you guys will see my prices. You will see my plans. You will see the details of my plans, and you will see my email. Please do not hesitate to contact me because um, I do love to hear from you guys, okay? Um, also, if you guys are going through heartbreak um, and uh, having a hard time letting go, karmic relationship, visit my website, hrhnikitero.com, hrhnikitero.com. I pray that those articles will um, will help you, okay? Spent a lot of time writing those articles, you guys. Um, my website, I want you guys to know it's free, okay? It's free of charge. It costs you absolutely nothing. I pay out of my pocket a month for that, okay? For my subscribers, okay? Because I want to be able to at least, you know, besides doing tarot, I want to be able to help you in other ways in case you're going through some type of heartbreak karmic relationship stuff like that okay you can join that um website as well and it costs you absolutely nothing to join that website and i will be setting up my newsletters my newsletters pretty soon all right so with that being said you guys let's go ahead and give glory to where glory belongs all right i prayed over this clarifiers in the name of the father the son and the holy spirit okay you guys i have asked for truth revelation confirmation guidance consolation peace and protection as i give jesus christ all the praise the honor and the glory so this is what we're expecting in this read okay somebody wants to get the crazy suit sexy cool back somebody is tired of this put on here they're ready to get out here all right they're ready to make a move they're ready for they're, re they're ready for action they're ready for movement and they're ready for some new sex as a matter of fact they've been thinking about this they got one foot in and one foot out okay don't know maybe this video is gonna push them to go on ahead and do it all right listen they they don't want anything heavy hard hard and heavy somebody is very lighthearted. they want to flirt around they want to date around they just want to let their hair down and just beat them okay However, we do have somebody in mental anguish. We got somebody at a stalemate. Somebody could be married here, Aries, okay? And somebody does not seem satisfied with this here because we got mental anguish. We got stalemate, emotional block. We got insecure. We got waiting on something. And we got decisions again, okay? Leo Sagittarius Aries is here. Somebody is giving and giving to this connection, or you giving and giving, or somebody's giving and giving to uh, somebody else. Somebody's remembering this to the, to the wands. I don't think that is enough. Somebody is um, blinded to the truth. Somebody is having an emotional block here. Somebody cannot see all of the facts, even though they are defensive. They're ready from the left and they're ready from the right, you guys. Um, this person has to make a decision, okay? This decision for change. Um, 
family home or commitment is sitting right next to this. So whatever decision is going to be made, I think the reason why decision is coming up so much is because it is going to affect something here. And what I feel like it's going to affect Aries is I feel like it's going to affect either the family, either the home, the kids, or the commitment, okay? That is the reason why the decision is taking so long to be made. Virgo Taurus Capricorn just pulled up, you guys. This is somebody that is supposed to be at home. This is somebody supposed to be getting it for the home. It's supposed to be a mature person. This is a baby mom, a baby dad, or somebody who, you know, is supposed to just be responsible, okay? This person is out kicking it. This person is out doing what they supposed that ain't got no business doing, hanging around wrong people. Family members are, um, you know, negative, toxic family members, karmic family members, possibly third-party situations. So, yeah, somebody's defensive, okay? Somebody been thinking about taking action about this defensiveness. Strong will, okay? Somebody has been under attack. Y'all could have possibly threw hands, arguments, and disagreements, definitely. Somebody's ready to cut this person off in a very ruthless, roguish ass way, as a matter of fact, okay? With the King of Swords, okay? Libra, Gemini, Aquarius just pulled up. When it comes, look, somebody got clarity. It's just that simple, all right? Somebody got clarity that they're ready to cut this shit off. It's just that simple. I don't know if they did it or not, okay? Strength is here, all right? Strength is here. Somebody's ready to walk, walk into their purpose. They're ready to let their hair down. They're ready to be who they are and live life out loud, okay? Right, and they're ready to be single and abundant, okay? It's just that simple, all right? That's going towards their purpose, all right? Don't know who you're going to meet when you get there. When it comes down to this four of wands, this soulmate twin flame connection, this uh, love, baby mom, baby daddy, this separation versus longing, somebody wants a reunion, somebody wants this to work. It's a fucking burden, y'all. That's twice now, okay? It's twice. It's a burden. Somebody is burdened by this individual, okay? Somebody gives somebody headaches. Somebody makes somebody sick. Somebody gives somebody the silent treatment. Somebody is just really pretty much over it, okay? With the six of cups, all right? Doesn't mean that somebody's not going to want to mend it, though. This person is somebody who you've known for quite a while, okay? But listen, it's just it's a simple situation. Uh, somebody is just indifferent to this person. They do not like their behavior. They do not like the, how they show up in the relationship. They do not like their attitude. And they're pessimistic, okay? They're in apathy, all right? And with the six to the four, that means that you guys were either married or you guys thought about married, marriage or you guys are married, okay? Um, give me um, this uh, two of pentacles because I truly believe this got something to do with the job. Two of pentacles, defining two of pentacles, okay? Um, four of pentacles. Somebody does it. Somebody's fear of loss. Somebody's um, they're juggling, wishing, washing, mixed messages. Definitely, definitely at a fork in the road, but also fear of loss. Okay, that has something to do with this here decisions that need to be made with this here coworker. We got Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio that just pulled up. Okay, so I don't know if that's them that's being toxic. Patterns. Cross Watcher energy can and will get involved in all this. Cross Watcher, I want you guys to know that I love Cross Watcher just like I love Aries. Um, if this is an Aries that's done this to you, please let me know. I'm very interested to know how energy interchanges in between my reads and you'll be helping me out a lot. Cross Watcher, I love you. Like, share, and subscribe. Listen, somebody's working hard. Somebody is definitely working hard on something, okay? Somebody's also watching you. Um, somebody needs somebody needs to be in prepare, preparation, okay? Preparation for this love, okay? I don't know if this is a new love, okay? Could be somebody you see. Could be a Gemini. Could be a Virgo towards Capricorn. Listen, it's one of your options, okay? Or vice versa. Cross-watcher, whoever, Okay? But whatever it is, it's good times, it's wishes granted, okay? It's um it's it's happiness, it's comfort and comfortability, all right? Somebody might walk off to this, okay? I got the two to the seven to the eight, all right? So um 16, 15, 6. Yeah, this is an ending. Somebody's leaving, okay? It's just that simple. Somebody left or somebody's leaving, all right? Yeah, they already planned to do this, you guys. They already knew they was gonna do this. Okay, so that could be the job or that could be the person. Give me the 10 cups. Somebody also needs to make a decision on this. Lover situation. We got third party situation going on here. Somebody got a third party situation. Somebody's thinking about leaving for this third party situation. 
while somebody else is clinging on to this relationship because there's betrayal and backstabbing here, okay? So I don't know who to, all right? I don't know if you're the one that's backstabbing and you're planning on leaving for somebody else and you're tired of the job or I don't know if it's them, okay? All I know is it's somebody, this is a very painful ending, somebody's spying, okay? Somebody damn sure is getting information, okay, on this third party situation and on this, um, on this, um, this person is from a distance. Travel may be here. Travel may be included. Travel is what they may do. Okay. Relocation, um, relief, um, wanting peace after the storm, leaving past alone. Okay. Somebody is spying on you know, somebody who is doing that. Okay. There is a, a change. So something's going to happen here. We got a cycle that's ending. And we got one that's beginning. Okay. Somebody's ready to release and purge this. Right. And they're they're ready to go into their dreams. They, they want to walk into their dreams coming true. They got foresight. They want to explore. Okay. Didn't I say that they want to involve themselves in external things? They're ready to let their hair down. They just want to be them. They want to live 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 life out loud. Okay. And they want to walk into their dreams. And they are going to. It's just that simple. They're guarded against anything that's going to come up against this. And while somebody is walking into their dreams and having foresight, somebody's having an emotional funeral. Somebody is having a haunted loss. Once somebody releases, surrenders, and purges somebody, somebody will be very, very sad, okay? And I'm going to give you guys some letters. You guys know how this goes. Go back to the last few videos and try to put some of these letters together. What I'm looking for is um, names. Initials are okay. If you guys are a verified subscriber, you guys know how it goes, okay? Um, put your if your, your, your um, situation down there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Put your situation down there, and I will randomly pull cards for you. Community members, this is a perk, okay? As long as you got a badge by your name. And community members, a lot of you guys have my um, tarot line. If you guys are not interested in putting your situation down in the personal comments, go ahead and text me, okay, with these letters. And I'll pull for you that way, all right? We got two E's, you guys. We got two E's. We got R. We got M. We got X. We got F. We got W. And we got K, all right? Two E's. The letter R, the letter V, the letter M, the letter X, the letter F, and the letter K. All right? So let me tell y'all who's on the board, you guys. We got Scorpio. Virgo towards Capricorn. Somebody's spying, you guys. There is a third party situation. Somebody's getting mighty close to somebody. Somebody might have already dipped and left. Or they're damn sure thinking about it. They got plenty of options. Somebody's up in their skills, mastery. Somebody might be getting a new job here. But somebody needs to prepare for some information here. Cancer Pisces Scorpio. You got haters, okay? Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. And, uh, and also, you see me read that card. So not only do you got eight haters, they're also calling you out your name. All right? Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. Got a lot of Leo, Sagittarius, Aries here. Um, who else do I have here? Leo, Sagittarius. Okay? So, with that being said, you guys, um, I hope I was able to put one piece together for you. If I did, that means that I've definitely done my job. I'd appreciate it if you like, share, and subscribe. I love you. Aries to death. See you soon.